I would now like to share with you a brief video highlighting this remarkable young social entrepreneurs. But before, may I ask the 10 nominees who are here with us today in the audience to rise so that we can acknowledge them. May we have the video. People say youth are the future. People say youth are the future. People say we are the leaders of tomorrow. But all around the world, young people like me. Young people like me. Like me. Like me. Are changing the world today. 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 I have a thousand unemployed people finding jobs in Palestine. I have educated more than 11,000 people about the harmful effects of smoking. I have advocated the importance of recycling to more than 8,000 students and employees. It's about taking action. 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 I have built a database of 5,000 blood donors to assist patients in need. I have created audio stories that benefited 120 blind children. I have benefited hundreds of people through microloans and cultural exchange. It's about dreaming big. 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 Very big. I have created a technology that enables the deaf to be heard. We have equipped 5,000 low-income youth in Egypt with employment skills. What's your vision? What's your vision? Your vision. I envision an Arab world where the deaf can be heard. I envision a Palestine where people have jobs. I envision Lebanon where patients get the care they need. I envision an Egypt where all young people are engaged in social change. I envision a world where everyone is equal. I envision a greener world where people act responsibly. I envision a world where all children hear powerful stories. I envision a world where people don't smoke. What can we do together? Together. Together. Shukran al Malik Jalal Tan Malik ala hai fursa tamina. La imanak min shari'ana. Shukran ya Jalal Tan Malik, in inta amin tamina. King Abdullah the second award for youth innovation and achievement. Taking the future forward. This year's award is being given to four individuals in honor of their innovative solutions, outstanding track records, and far-reaching visions for the future. I now have the pleasure to announce the King Abdullah II Award for Youth Innovation and Achievement Winners for the year 2009. From Sudan, Abba Karim Petri, who invented a device <laughs> Abdel Karim Petri, who invented a device that enables the deaf to be heard through translating Arabic sign language into an audible voice. From Egypt, Rada El Ebrashi. She is encouraging a spirit of volunteerism among Egyptian students while promoting sustainable models of development benefiting low-income youth in Old Cairo. For Palestine, Lana Mahdi Hichazi She has pioneered the use of mobile technology to enable 
a growing number of Palestinian job seekers to, ac to access employment opportunities. And finally, from Jordan, Ravi Suraikat. <laughs> Promoting greater social equality in the southern Jordan through facilitating knowledge exchange to build bridges among different community sectors. <laughs> 